For growing specialty potatoes, how do you get started? Today, I'm visiting Irish Eyes Garden Seeds Farm. From the outside, this looks like a typical potato farm, but farmer Greg Latoski doesn't grow potatoes to sell in the supermarket. He grows seed potatoes for at-home gardeners. Well, tell me about your farm and how you got started in all this. I was, uh, had just finished uh, with a business that I had just sold. And really, I was taking some time and doing some gardening. We had a really large garden down in Sumner, Washington. Mm -hmm. And we planted some potatoes for the first time. And my girls were in kindergarten. And mm -hmm. every day, they loved to come home and dig potatoes. Oh, it was like treasure in the ground. And just kind of fell in love with potatoes. Started doing some research on how to grow seed potatoes. And 27 years later, and we're growing 80 acres of specialty potatoes. Greg says they grow 20 different varieties of seed potatoes. And we've got to be real careful not to mix the varieties. Oh, okay. And that we have stakes at the beginning and the end of each rose, and you can see by the color differences. Um, yeah, just by looking at the greenery. Potatoes are very diverse, very, very pretty. And this one here is Yukon gem. gem, which is uh, very interesting to organic growers because it is late blight resistant. Can we look at one? Sure. Yeah. And late blight is the, uh, the fungal disease that, that caused the potato famine. Mm -hmm. We do a lot of digging of potatoes at this time of year to seeing if they're large enough mm -hmm. to, uh, to get ready for harvest. And are these? Uh, no, this is no. actually a, a mid to late season potato. So this one here will you can see here it's still setting potatoes. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. So this one's probably about at least three weeks away. Okay. Greg grows a large variety of colored potatoes, including purple, lavender, red, and yellow. So when the consumer, when people order your um, seeds, what, how do you how do you plant them at home? Well, the uh, the seed potato will look very much like the potato that you'd purchase at the store. Okay. Um, it's just gone through a different type of growing practice. Mm -hmm. And when, when you get them at home, you, you're actually, the tubers are gonna look like just like the one you have in your hand there. Mm -hmm. And what you'd wanna do is put them in a warm area, mm -hmm. um, even in the direct sun. And as it starts to dehydrate a little bit, those little eyes around the potato mm -hmm. will start to swell and grow. Okay. And after you see those, then it's pretty easy to be able to cut the different seed pieces. Okay. And the cool thing about the potato is, when you plant that potato, you get the exact same thing back. If you could, uh, you know, tell the people of Washington, you know, what it's like to be a farmer, what would you say? We would just uh, really like the people to know that, you know, it's hard work, and uh, you know, hug a farmer. Okay, <laughs> here you go, man. Thank you. <laughs>